Good morning, boys and girls. This is Mr. Cordova. I hope that you had a great weekend over the weekend. Uh, we are going to have a great week this week. It is Monday, May 1st. We're already into the month of May. And in June, that is our last month of school. Not the full month, but we have two weeks of June. And then we are done with the 2016-17 school year. So we are moving very quickly. And before we move on, uh, we will be doing the state testing. That's the CASP testing that's going to be happening and starting next week. So we are preparing for that. And all students in grades 3 through 6 will be participating in that testing. Let's see what we have uh, going on. We have our grade level winners for Accelerated Reader. The following grade level winners are the winners for last week. First grade, Miss Walker, 28.2. Second grade, Miss Sykes, 18.0. Third grade, Miss Hansen, 72.1. Wow, that's pretty big. Fourth grade, Miss Vasquez Thomas, 14.5. Fifth grade, Miss Lara, 81.4. Sixth grade, Miss Wynn, 17.5. Congratulations to our grade level winners. Individual student winners are first grade, Camilla from Miss Moniz, 6.2. Second grade, Danielle from Miss Sykes, 3.1. Third grade, Aishna. Aish nah from Ms. Hansen's class, 15.3. Fourth grade, Alberto, Alberto from Ms. Vasquez Thomas, 5.1. Uh, fifth grade, Miter from Ms. Laura's class, 39.6. Wow, there you go. And sixth grade, Jalissa from Ms. Merrill's class, 8 points. Congratulations. We are at a total of 6,901 points. We are trying to get to 10,000 for movie day. Let's try to get there before the end of the year. I know we can do it. Uh, what do we have going on throughout the week? We have EL Academy on Tuesdays and Thursdays, and we also have after-school tutoring as well. Uh, we have some field trips going on. Wednesday is always our communication day and early out Wednesday for grades 1 through 6. And let's see, Mesa is on Thursdays as well. And we have talent show practice scheduled in the multi-purpose room on Friday from 2.20 to 3.30. So talent show is a big deal. That's coming up as well. I think that's about all the news that we have for today, boys and girls. We do have some visitors that are going to be coming to our school and asking students about our rules and what does ROAR mean. Uh, ROAR stands for be respectful, be outstanding, be safe, and be responsible. So we want to hear students roaring at all times. That is about all of our news for today, boys and girls. Let's make it a great day, a great day for learning, and it's always a great day to be a Lionbach Lion.